Just wait for it. And it has opened up a Firefox window and it went to github.com. Hey guys, welcome to Tech Notebook, and in this video I will be showing you how to set up the Selenium web driver for Mozilla Firefox. So let's get started. So as I've said in some of my previous tutorials, Selenium is a tool for browser automation. It is commonly used in the field of unit testing, but in our case we can use it to do almost anything we want, like clicking on buttons on a website, or anything else that we feel like doing. So before we can start programming, we will first need to go to this link right here. And I will have this link below in the description. And we will need to install the Gecko driver. So that's basically the Firefox's version of the Google Chrome driver or the Microsoft Edge driver. So we just need to scroll down and select the one for our operating system. Uh, mine is the win64.zip. So let's just click that and it will download the file. So now we will need to relocate it into the folder that we want, or you can just leave it in your downloads folder. Okay, so now we have our gecko driver uh, folder in here and we will just need to extract this zip file. We'll just extract this in this directory and it opened up the folder and now we see that we have the gecko driver.exe file. So we'll just move this to our root path and we can just delete these two folders. And now we can see that there is the gecko driver.exe file right here. Now what we will have to do is to actually get the file path. And the way we do that is by right clicking it, going down into properties. And we just need to copy this location and hit OK and exit that. And now we'll need to open our text editor of choice. I choose to use VS Code. So now we'll just need to open up a terminal window and I will use the integrated terminal. And what we'll need to type in is pip install selenium. And I spelled install wrong, so let's redo that. And it tells me that the requirement is already satisfied and I have selenium installed. So now we'll just need to create a new Python file. So we will need to call this something other than selenium.py because that will interfere with our import of selenium. And you cannot have any of the files in this directory or any of the folders have just selenium in its name. You'll need to have something other than selenium.py or the folder named selenium. And so in this file, the first thing we'll need to type in is from selenium import web driver. And this will import the web driver module of selenium, which we can use to control our browser. And so now we'll need to create an instance of the Firefox web driver. And the way we do that is by typing in driver equals web driver dot Firefox. And now we will need to um, tell Selenium where the executable for Gecko driver is. And the way we do that is just by typing in executable path equals, and now we'll need to create a raw string, open up quotation marks, and we will need to paste our path for the Gecko driver. And what we'll need to do on the end is just type in a backslash and then Gecko driver.exe. So now finally, what we will need to do is just type in driver.get and we'll need to go to a website. For example, we can go to GitHub. So let's go to HTTPS colon slash slash github.com. And this line just tells the browser to go to this website. So now if we click run, just wait for it and it has opened up a Firefox window and it went to github.com. So if this worked for you, you successfully completed this tutorial. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and I will see you in the next video.